Okay guys, time for your next challenge. So, the challenge is going to be, you're gonna have to talk to a famous celebrity. Oh yeah, now we're talking. I've always talked to a lot of celebrities. No biggie. So the celebrity you're going to be talking to is Wendy. Yo! Oh my gosh, it feels so good to be on camera again. <laughs> uh, a little closer, please. Ah, uh, that's better. Ooh. Ah, uh, yeah. Wendy, remember what your contract said. Yeah, 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 I know. I'm not a brainiac, Larry. And why would she be over here? Instead of, like, no other celebrity. Well, she's an online celebrity, so, yeah, her... Her post on... On Instagram has been really famous. <laughs> oh, yeah, you know it, and you can't just... Be all grudgy about my looks, I mean... <laughs> I've worked so hard to look this beautiful! <laughs> mm-hmm. Yep, that's Wendy for you. If anybody ask, Wendy's Instagram account doesn't exist IRL. It's just only something in the multiverse. That's all. <laughs> now basically, how this is going to work is that you're going to um have a little short conversation with Wendy and uh you gotta at least say some compliments about her looks. And if you, uh... And of course, uh... I'll be the judge based on what, how Wendy feels about each of you. So, uh, yeah. Anyways, starting from Rosalina the Peso, let's get started. <sighs> let's get this over with. I have more Instagram posts to do anyway. <sighs> Greetings, Wendy. Oh, it's you, the, the princess of the galaxy. <laughs> oh my gosh, I was I was a princess, like Princess Toadstool. <sighs> oh, he, I predict that this won't really happen. <laughs> How do you know? Fortune tellers never tell a lie. <clears throat> Whatever, but still. That dress of yours is like so tacky. Pink would look so much better on you now that I think about it. Blue represents the galaxy. The color of a dark blue galaxy. Including the stars. Yellow represents the color of stars, which I love. And I can see that your bracelets represent the color of stars, which is yellow. Oh, you, you actually like my bracelets? Hmm, based on the color, I like it. Ah, finally, at least someone likes my bracelets. Well, I'm not the only one who likes your bracelets the most. Oh, really? <sighs> Seriously, I gotta look at my Instagram account and see who likes my bracelets because I post pictures of them, so yeah. Okay, then. Ah. <sighs> Well, I can see why you like them. <laughs> mm -hmm. Not bad, Rosalina. You pass. Thank you. I predicted this would happen. Next up, Shy Guy. Hello there. No. Ugh, he's hideous. <laughs> what even is behind his mask? I would rather not show you. No. Just take off your mask. Take Take off your mask! I want to see what's behind it! Uh, I'm probably expecting some hot looks on you! Ow, oh, I don't want you to do that! No, 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 no. What is your problem? I just want to see what's behind the mask! Nobody touches the mask. No. Uh, you're still hideous with the mask. Whatever. Could you at least try to compliment some parts of me? The necklace is red. Red is my favorite color. No. Oh, really? So that's one reason why you like 
My necklace. <laughs> Lame. You failed, shy guy. I always keep my identity hidden. No. So that's why I wear this mask. No. Anyone who dares touch your hands on my mask will try to reveal myself. Especially in public, you know. I will show no mercy on them. No. Next up is Morton. Hey, Wendy. It's me, Morton. Ugh. Morton, hi. So, I can't believe you got back in the game. Morton just got lucky. Plus, he was brought back by popular demand. Oh, <laughs> what a surprise. But I thought Waddle D was brought back by popular demand. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Morton was. <laughs> Whatever. But still. <sighs> You're still very fat. It's because Morton eats a lot. <laughs> and of course, you stink as always. Oh, Sally, Morton must have eaten some chili dogs. <sighs> Could you at least try to compliment a part of me? Uh, Morton likes the greenness of your wand because it represents the greenness of Morton's skin. Ugh, what a pathetic reason to like the grayness of my wand. <laughs> I can't believe that. Morton did his best, though. Yeah, you didn't, so you failed. You know me. <laughs> Gag me! <sighs> Morton, I swear, you should probably start to work out so you can get... More thinner. I mean, seriously, what is wrong with you? Honestly, Morton doesn't know. Uh, next up is Roy. <laughs> What's up, babe? Uh, Roy, I thought I told you not to call me that in public. Wait a minute. You two are dating? Uh, duh. What'd you expect anyway? Oh, I don't know. It's just, uh... I wasn't sure who Wendy... Was interested in too. <laughs> She's more interesting to me just because of my, just because of my looks and my hot muscles. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, I love it when you do that, Roy. <laughs> That's what I expect from you. <laughs> oh yeah, you're looking great today. Oh here, let me actually just. Mm. There you go. Now it'll make you look more pretty. Oh, Roy, thank you so much. I needed that. <sighs> Your browns will attract more viewers anyway. <laughs> I just know it. Oh, yes, yes, yes! I really, really do love that! <laughs> so, you want to go out with me as soon as this challenge is over? If I win? Of course, I would love to, handsome. <sighs> Call me when you win! <laughs> well, Roy, you passed. Definitely. Oh, yeah, no, that's what I'm talking about. See how good that was, y'all? That's how it's done. Next up is Waddle D. Oh, you have no mouth. Why is that? understand what you're saying. Can someone at least translate? I'll do the translation for you. Is this allowed, Larry? Um, ever since you can't talk, then go ahead and translate. Thank you. Waddle Dee says he doesn't have a mouth because Waddle Dees are born with that. Oh, that's like weird. Science could be so weird these days, like genetics and stuff. He says you don't have to be so paranoid about just because the way Waddle Dees are. I'm not that paranoid, I'm just questioning. That's all. Waddle Dee uh, says asks that you're a celebrity, right? Uh, duh! I mean, do you, 
have you even seen my Instagram page before? Like, did you see how many views it has? It's so many followers. Ah, oh, man, I, I would be so swell to meet awesome more celebrities and even make my way to the top. Waddle Dee says that your, that your lips were, remind him of his squishy little cheeks. Oh. Oh my gosh, your cheeks really are so squishy. I do actually appreciate that, Waddle Dee. <laughs> you gotta admit, you are pretty cute for a Waddle Dee. I wish I had one as a pet. Waddle Dee appreciates the offer, but... He's not sure about being your pet. <sighs> oh, don't worry about it. I'm really wishing that I had another wild deed I could do. That could be just like a maid. Wild Dee says he understands completely. Oh, good, good. Uh, I really enjoy seeing you every day, especially those cute little puffy cheeks. That was great, Wild Dee. Quite surprised he did good. <sighs> How can you translate his language? Yeah, even though we can't speak. Well, fortune tellers like me do have the ability to predict what people are going to eventually say. And I have the power to translate languages. Even my shagger language? Like, yes, I can. Next up is Jigglypuff. Jigglypuff! Oh, look at you. You look like a ball. I'm not a ball. I'm, I'm the balloon Pokemon. See? Huh? Every time I jump, I come down slowly. Huh. Oh, okay then. You look like a cat, but only if your hair was removed. You would look so much better like that, and your eyes, they should really be fixed. I could probably put some manicure on you. I wouldn't want that because I still like the way I am, despite my short arms. I wish I had arms like you. I'll grow up for all I care. I also have a song. Wanna hear it? No, 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 Jigglypuff, don't. Aw, okay. Huh. Boing! Boing! What are you doing? Boing! I'm just jumping around so I can get a better look at you. Boing! Hmm, I don't find anything interesting, but overall, I can see why you, uh... Put on this fancy stuff. Well, it's always been my hobby, and I don't see why you don't find anything interesting of me. How rude. <sighs> hmm. If, if only I saw something on you that looked like a crescent moon, it would be so much better. Uh, you can't change the way I look. That's like... <laughs> Not right to me. I like the way I am. I don't want to change my looks. Why are you saying that? Yeah, that wasn't a pass, Jigglypuff. Oh man, I tried. Next up is Hitmonchan. Oh, Wendy. <laughs> Hitmonchan, I've seen you in many boxing matches. And... <laughs> I gotta say, you aren't exactly all that attractive. What? What do you mean? I adore Hitmontop more than just you do. Oh. Alright, I'm okay with that. <sighs> but Hitmontlee is quite rude whenever he taunts you. I mean, like, that's not good sportsmanship. I mean, like, hello? How does that guy even learn better than that? <laughs> uh, Hitman Lee is just so annoying. <laughs> he never learns. Never does. 
I find him on top of more attractive than you because he does cool tricks with his feet and his hands. Oh yeah, him on top. It sort of like spins like on a top like this. Oh. That was rather lame. Uh, yeah, I deserve to get that. <sighs> Say, you should probably not wear those boxing gloves often. Well, I would only have... I'm wearing them, like, all the time. It's like only if I would try to fight someone, like, you know, usual. Ow! <sighs> oh, my bad. <sighs> yeah, I'm not gonna lie. You're not exactly as good as him on top. I've beaten him many times, and he's beaten me some, but still. Ugh. And why would you wear some kind of, like, ballet dress? Are you, like, in ballet or something? What? No! Ugh. Now that was a fail, Hitmonchan. Oh man. Ugh. If only it was a different celebrity! Ugh. Next is Meowth. Prepare for trouble as Meowth strikes back! That didn't even rhyme! <laughs> Lame! Look, Jesse and James are around, you get it? <sighs> I only came into this game because they forgot me! In the start of season two, but I'm lucky to be back. <sighs> <sighs> Ugh, you're annoying either way. Hey, come on! At least I find your bracelets to look good, just like my charm. Oh, you like my bracelets, huh? <laughs> but your charm looks like pure gold. Mind if I have it? No! No! Don't take my charm! It's the only thing I ever need! <laughs> Don't you ever make money being a celebrity? Why would you even ask me that? That is none of your business. Why would you even tell me then? That's like the only thing celebrities could do. They would only gain followers, not just money. I don't care about the money, see? I care about the followers. I just want to be attractive as usual and a popular celebrity. Now that's my girl right there. <laughs> oh, Roy, you're making me blush. Ugh, not gonna lie, but your relationship with him is just annoying as usual. <laughs> that is so rude of you, Meowth. <laughs> Yeah, don't talk to my girlfriend like that. You failed me off. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> Take that. Let's see how you do that, huh? Alright. Next is Espeon. Hmm. So, are you gonna at least try to say something? Oh no, not really. I honestly don't really care about seeing you. I was expecting to see more of a better celebrity who's more of a psychic type like me. Psychic? <laughs> How do you even use psychic powers? Like, oh my gosh, that's like... The most insane thing I've ever heard. You honestly never heard of psychic type Pokemon? <sighs> what a brainiac, you really gotta learn more about Pokemon. That is like so rude! <sighs> I can't believe you! <sighs> Honestly, I never really care about any, any of your looks, but the purple in this one is nice. <sighs> Either way, I still like the, I don't really approve of the necklace, but the red color is nice. But still... Okay, okay. You were just being straight up rude right now, but... <sighs> Honestly, I never really expected you and Roy to be dating, but, um... No offense, but, um... You both seem to have different things in common, so I don't see why you both got together. Just because of your looks and what your talents are. Oh. My. Gosh, it's like the most rudest thing I've ever heard. 
even where the meows. <laughs> I knew you judged someone worse. Oh, Wendy, Wendy, that's enough. All right, fine. Espion, you failed. Hmm. <sighs> Next up is Courtney. Oh, hi there. Uh, she is so ugly. Like, uh, what kind of clothes is she wearing? Oh, you know, just usual Octarian army uniforms. <laughs> uh, I also heard you were like a a juvie delinquent. Oh, that was because I got sent in jail for the for some stuff I did. Of course, the plush police caught me and put a chip in my stomach. That doesn't affect me at all, really. I've been innocent, too. <laughs> I am much more attractive, unlike you. Uh, rude! Hmm, doesn't really matter either way. I'm more better than you. <laughs> And I know I could prove this one day. <laughs> uh, just get her out of my sight. She's annoying me already. Okay, okay. Courtney, you failed. Ah, uh, well, it's not really my fault that it wasn't the kind of celebrity I was expecting. Next up is Marie. Oh, it's you, Wendy. Marie? <sighs> Hmm, not gonna lie, but I thought about this for a long time, but your bow with the polka dots is nice. It reminds me of my little thing I wear on my head. Oh, really? You like my polka dots? <laughs> no wonder I have polka dot pajamas. <laughs> yeah, not gonna lie, I really like that. Oh! <laughs> Thank you. I, I can't believe you would see that about that stuff. I know. <sighs> I'm much more of a kind of person who's just chill. People like me for that. Yeah, same with my cousin. I like your attitude already. Unlike Callie, she's just, like, too excited. Yeah, Callie can be happy-go-lucky all the time. That's just a pretty much her. Okay, then. How about we, like, meet up each other again at some point? Maybe when you're not in Total Step Plush Island? That would be nice. Okay, then. Not bad, Marie. You pass. Thank you. Last but not least, Peso. Oh, uh, hi, uh, Wendy, is it? Yeah, you don't even know my name? No, not really. I... It's my first time meeting you. I've never actually heard of you before. But... I mean, I've heard about you a few times, but still. Uh, I can't believe it's your first time meeting me! I mean, hello! You don't recognize the looks and stuff? Well, i never seen your looks before, but now I am in person. Hmm. I'm just gonna be honest, but, um... I, uh... think you look good in those looks, but, um, it's not really all that interesting to me. I don't love or like anything. It's just, it's good. Good? <sighs> I like it when people love. I love my blank looks. <sighs> Not just something, like, interesting. <sighs> I'm sorry, it's just, talking to celebrities isn't exactly as easy as you think. Hmm. Ugh, whatever. Peso, you failed. Ah. Uh. Wendy and I discussed of your conversations, and of course, Roy won because he did best. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about, babe. <laughs> Roy. Oh, I mean, sorry, Wendy. Ah, that's more like it. Anyway, so uh, Shy Guy, Morton, uh, Jigglypuff, Hitmonchan, Meowth, Espeon, Courtney, and Peso, zero elimination. Elimination time. So, the following people are safe. Okay, so, Jigglypuff, Shy Guy, Morton, and 
Hitmonchan. Now it's down to you three. First one with uh, only a few votes is uh, Courtney. Good! And now it's down to you two. Meowth and Espeon. The person that will be safe from tonight's elimination is... Meowth. Ah, oh, yeah! That's what I'm talking about! Meowth will still be in the game! Ha-ha! <laughs> what? No! Impossible! You're in luck because this is a non-elimination round! Wait, really? Yes! Ha! <laughs> Just kidding! No! <sighs> oh well. I did good in the game anyway, of this season. Unlike season one. Either way, I played a good game. So long. And I'll see you next season or whenever. And with that, Espeon, the psychic of evolution of Eevee, is out of the game. What will happen on the next episode? Find it on Total Stealth Plush Island Season 2. Bye!